Hello, in this video, I am going to cover integer literals. So a integer literal is basically a integer number, but it's just, it's constant, it's fixed. A literal is when, if I put, let's say, int i equals five, for example, i would be the literal part of it. So obviously there's a few requirements for it to be an integer literal. So literal is just when you specifically put a number. For it to be an integer, it has to be a whole number, there has to be no decimal part of it and some valid integer literals are so let's say if it said i equals five as i have already done above that's valid if i would say i equals five u that is also valid what comment it properly valid and that is unsigned so if you have u there it's unsigned if you don't have you, it's just regular signed and you don't need to specify that it is signed. If I say i equals something like 0x or 5, you know, f, e, e, you know, like that, that is also valid because so that equates to 4078. This is hexadecimal. If you have 0x, it is using the hexadecimal format. And if I was to say i do equals trying to think what else I could do I could say three um, it doesn't make sense of me doing it with you know the number three but you could put out there and that makes it along as well so those are the valid ones let me briefly cover what's not valid so if those are valid I with equal to zero seven eight for example would not be valid because we've got zero at the start you might think okay if I in real life write at zero seven eight you just read the other probably seventy eight if it's just a number but it's if put zero it's interprets it as an octal digit so that is not valid invalid invalid octal digit and all this will be you know in the source code on github and if i do another one i equals 0 32 uu and that is also invalid and but why is this one invalid this time and the reason is because you are repeating suffixes it's not properly giving you an error but it's because we have repeated the u suffix it is considered as invalid so uh, suff fixes i think that's how you spell it cannot be repeated so that's integer literals i'll have separate videos covering character literals float literals feel so feel free to check them out if you have any questions you can post on the discord group there's a link in the description over 4300 members now there's plenty of programming channels look forward to seeing you there look forward to seeing you in the next programming video and as usual bye bye